Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we're exploring extruded polystyrene insulation, commonly known as XPS. If you're looking to boost your home's energy efficiency, slash those utility bills, and create a more comfortable living space, you're in the right place. Before we get into the specifics of XPS, let's quickly touch on why insulation is crucial. Proper insulation acts as a barrier to heat flow, helping maintain consistent indoor temperatures year-round. This not only improves comfort, but also reduces energy consumption, leading to lower bills and a smaller carbon footprint. What is XPS insulation? Extruded polystyrene, XPS, is a rigid foam insulation made from polystyrene, a synthetic polymer derived from petroleum. The manufacturing process creates a closed cell structure, resulting in durable, moisture-resistant foam boards. These boards come in various thicknesses and densities to suit different insulation needs. Applications of XPS insulation. Let's explore some common applications. Wall insulation, XPS can be used in cavity walls or as external wall insulation, significantly reducing heat loss. Its closed cell moisture resistant makeup is ideal for use on external walls where driving rain may be a concern. Roof insulation, it's excellent for both flat and pitched roofs, preventing heat transfer between the interior and exterior. It can also bear the weight of the structure above the insulation, such as roof tiles and timbers. XPS is ideal for underfloor insulation or beneath concrete slabs. Its high compressive strength makes it perfect for load-bearing applications in both residential and commercial projects. Foundation insulation. It can be used to insulate the exterior of foundation walls, helping to maintain consistent basement temperatures. Benefits of XPS insulation. Thermal performance. XPS provides excellent thermal resistance, with R values typically ranging from 4.5 to 5 per inch of thickness. The thermal conductivity of XPS is around 0.033 watts per meter. Its closed cell structure effectively keeps out moisture, protecting against damp and associated problems like mold and mildew. Even when wet, it can maintain its insulating properties when other products like mineral wool would lose theirs durability. Available in various sizes and thicknesses, XPS adapts to many different insulation needs. The boards are easy to handle and install, reducing labour and installation costs. Let's compare XPS to some other common insulation materials. R value per inch. XPS has an R value of 5, EPS has an R value of 4, and PIR has an R value of 6 to 6.5. Thermal conductivity, watts per metre Kelvin. XPS has a thermal conductivity of 0.033 watts per meter. EPS ranges from 0.0636 to 0.038 watts per meter Kelvin, and PIR ranges from 0.022 to 0.028 watts per meter Kelvin. Moisture resistance. XPS has higher moisture resistance, EPS has lower moisture resistance, and PIR has similar moisture resistance to XPS. Compressive strength. XPS has a compressive strength of 200 to 500 kilopascal. EPS has compressive strength of 70 to 80 kilopascals. And PIR has a compressive strength of 120 to 150 kilopascal. Cost. XPS has a medium cost, EPS has a lower cost, and PIR has a higher cost. While XPS outperforms EPS in several areas, PIR offers better thermal performance. However, XPS has advantages in compressive strength and moisture resistance, so may be a better choice where the insulation may come into contact with water or rain, such as under swimming pools, hot tubs, or as external wall insulation. Disadvantages of XPS insulation It's important to consider the drawbacks. Environmental impact As a petroleum-based product, XPS has a higher global warming potential than some alternatives. Limited recyclability. The closed cell structure makes XPS more challenging to recycle than other materials. UV vulnerability. Prolonged exposure to sunlight can degrade the material, so it needs protection in exposed applications. Cost. XPS is generally more expensive than EPS, though typically less expensive than PIR. Fire safety. While XPS is treated with flame retardants, it's important to note that it's combustible with a Euroclass E fire rating, which is pretty poor. FAQs. Let's address some common questions. Is XPS good for soundproofing? While it provides some sound insulation, it's not specifically designed for soundproofing. There are better materials for this purpose, such as mineral wool. 
How long does XPS insulation last? When properly installed and protected, XPS can last for decades, often for the lifetime of the building. Can XPS be used for interior walls? Yes, but it's more commonly used for exterior applications such as roofs and external walls due to its moisture resistance properties. XPS insulation is a top performer in thermal efficiency, moisture resistance and durability. Its versatility makes it suitable for a wide range of applications, from foundations to roofs. However, it's crucial to weigh its benefits against environmental considerations and budget constraints. As technology advances, we can expect to see improvements in XPS's environmental profile. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like, subscribe, and leave any questions in the comments below. Looking for top quality XPS insulation? Visit Buy Insulation online today for the best options from leading brands. Improve your home's energy efficiency and make a positive impact on your carbon footprint.